Hello, friends, family, and America. Not to forget Canada and worldwide. This right here is my last video of this evening, and this is called What I'm Supposed to Believe. Let's start off with um, some things that's happened over the last week. Um, number one, the shooting in San Francisco of the supposed suspect from a crime that happened in Washington State. He didn't pay his, his uh, bus fare, so the cops got off of the hookup and shot him five times. Where the gun at? He, hey, he, he pulled a weapon on us, so we had to blast him five times. What? I'm supposed to believe that. My point is this, if he's a suspect, so you, you shoot him. Um, knowing about firearms like I do, I know that there's less than lethal methods of uh, subduing a, quote, suspect, such as a taser. But they tased him real good. My man died, and, um, and um, just like some videos you may see on YouTube, um, one, one comment I heard in the back of the video, and they go get away with this, too. That's why I say everyone should get straps if you can, you know, because the point of the Second Amendment, folks, is to protect the citizens, the people, uh, or commonly known as the slaves, from a tyrannical government. And that's what we have today. Not to mention, um, I'm not sure if any if you have checked out, uh, I believe it's uh, MAFA 21 or MAFA 11. If I'm not mistaken, but um, it tells about the history of, or no, sorry, that's incorrect. Look up the history of gun control. All you got to do is Google or start page um, the history of gun control, and you'll find out that the original gun control measures were put in place to prevent blacks, or politically correct here, African Americans from owning weapons. That's where gun control really started, folks. So go get yourself one, man. Don't be scared because most people who are scared of guns have never been around them. So get yourself some experience and get yourself one, okay? Um, and besides that, what? I'm supposed to believe that. Next, um, let's talk about uh, there's a thing Obama's doing. Oh, hey, yes, everyone, we're going to have to eat our peas, everybody. America, America, eat your peas, everybody. Uh, we got something here from uh, Captain Obama. Obama to add 20,000 troops to U.S. streets in the event of civil unrest. And the majority of them are going where, you might ask? Chicago. That's probably the next point of our false flag attack will be Chicago. And then all of our civil liberties will be taken away. You already know they got... Operation Fast and Furious. Like I mentioned in a video before, there's no Johnny Tran, there's no Vin Diesel, there's no Brian Spillner, there's no Hector talking about, you know what, tomorrow, today, now. None of that. They are running guns, man. They've been doing it for a long time. They've been running cocaine, heroin, weed, ecstasy, the whole nine. They run it all, folks. So don't get trapped. Don't get put in that trap, man. Don't run stuff for the government, man. You think you're making your own money, but you're sentencing sent yourself to uh, uh, things that you shouldn't be doing. But uh, everybody got to get money, so I understand what's what's going on in the hood. But still, man, don't run their own products for them. Um, but seriously, folks, twenty thousand troops coming to American shores. This is not the idea of. You know, bringing the troops home. That's a direct violation of posse comitatus because the people are not supposed to be policed by the military. This is not Soviet Russia or Nazi Germany yet, folks, yet. But the more you stay asleep, the more you usher it in. Wake up! And yes, I said it, Afro Prepper. What else we want to talk about? I mean, hey, anybody hear about the lady with TSA? And I'm not sure if she was white, black, Puerto Rican, or Haitian. She looked ethnic to me, so I'm going to say she's ethnic. Okay, folks, forgive me if I'm wrong. But TSA felt her up, so she felt TSA up. Ha ha ha! Not so bad.
go on with your bad self. And I guess, hey, they let her off because she wasn't buying it. Stand up for your rights, folks, you bunch of lames. Why are you out there? Oh, it could never happen to us. I'll just go on through and get radiated. Oh, it's America. <laughs> it's for our protection, everybody. Oh, it's our protection. Shut up, man. Ain't no towel heads. Ain't no Arabs. Ain't no... Uh, come on, man. They're not over here to kill us, man. They want the same dream you want. To own a house, provide for their family, and live a better life. Not under some tyrannical type government that... Oh, yes, you know. Everybody, eat your peas, America. That wants to bring in. You kidding me right now? What? I'm supposed to believe that. What else, man? Bank of America. Hey, stocks trading underneath $10. What does that signify? Probably another bailout. I ain't bailing nothing out. As soon as they talk about another bailout, I'm claiming 45 dependents on my taxes, and I ain't paying a damn thing. Holla at me, cuz. They'll be like, yes, uh, you owe us this. <laughs> I'll be like, oh, you a damn thing. You already done robbed me twice. Three times, for that matter. Anyway, I'm supposed to believe that. Well, I mean, everything you can you hear in the news is coming out is direct thing. I think here's another T-shirt. What? I'm supposed to believe that, folks. This is Afro Prepper. I'm sure we could talk about more stuff. We could. T I could there's not a video on YouTube long enough to explain how many times you could say what. I'm supposed to believe that. Anyway, everybody, thank you for your support. Please share the videos. I'm not a big person on copywriting or anything because everybody needs to hear this. And get up out of your slumber. It's, 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 it's cool to live in Disneyland. But it's not the wisest thing to do. It's uncomfortable knowing a lot of these things. But on the flip side where we all need to meet, it's the best thing for us. Because we've been gotten so lazy that we allowed everything to get out of control. We have to bring it, rein it back in, folks. And the only way we can do that is by using your brain. God gave you that gray matter in between your ears for a reason. Use it. And guess what, YouTube? You're censoring everything. And guess what? We gonna get you. Afro Prepper, we'll catch you on that wonderful place called the Flipside. Peace.